Here at WET, we create experiences that bring people together. Fountains have always been a connecting draw, a magnet, if you will, for people. What we work at really, really hard is making what we do seem really, really not hard. If you stand at the rail at the Bellagio, you don't see nozzles sticking up or any of the telltale signs. You see a beautiful, placid lake and then all of a sudden this show materializes, transforms and transfixes you and then completely disappears. When we started, I mean, we had to approach a developer and the first big part of the pitch was, here's what a fountain can do to your property. Now, every developer, architect, they, they plan for these fabulous fountain experiences and then we show them what we can do that is unique to their project, different from anything we have done before and really will be an icon for them, I mean, we create icons. You think of the Bellagio, icon for that hotel, for that city, for fountains on the planet. When we design, we are designing for 40, 100, maybe more years. When you create something that is truly enjoyable over and over again, then it lasts. I look back at features that we created 10, 20 years ago, they're still great because it was never about the technology. It was about the experience and the expression, and we exploited the best technology then. As technology has matured, the whole world has been attracted and fascinated by virtual experiences. It creates a craving in a human being for what's natural. We look at what technology we can use to exploit the real. I envy architects because when you're designing with uh, you know, steel girders or bricks, they kind of do what you tell them to do. We're working with water and it kind of doesn't. From the moment those water molecules escape from our control, they're under the hand of nature and the gift of God and the, and the forces of the wind. And so we don't finish the design here. We get it, you know, certain 60, 70% along and that final choreographic touch happens as a marriage with our partner, nature and water. There are two things that are really fun for me at WET. One is going around and co-mingling with all the talent we have because, I mean, we have pattern designers, we have optical engineers, we have architects and landscape architects, computer programmers, machinists here together to pull this off in a way that, at the end, when we're successful, looks easy and seamless. The second thing I love about WET is the current and future projects we're working on because we really don't repeat ourselves or, or want to. We're working on the new Changi Airport terminal. We designed the fountains in Dubai a few years ago and the Royal Atlantis that we're working on that opens you know, pretty soon is going to be one of those. So I mean, we, we just have a canvas of really exciting stuff. I'm very excited in our new work as we move forward in making our experiences even more immersive. How do we go from the thousands of jets that we control to the tens of thousands or beyond? Well, I'm not gonna tell you because that's one of our secrets that we're um, deep in the middle of, but it's pretty awesome.